real quickly, let me show you how to make these um, city lists. What happens is you get into some of these cities, like here, where you've got you know out of town area, and there's just like a bazillion of them. And this one isn't really bad. I remember in, in Houston, I had to race about half the cities because they were just all over the whole United States. Um, sometimes these counties and zip codes can get all wacky too. But we're just going to look at the city one. It's the exact same thing to do um, to do these. So you log into your IDX broker backend, click here on preferences. Go to city, county, zip code lists, and then let's uh, create a new list. I'm going to really, I'm going to make two types here, just depending on what works best for you. Um, if you're just, if you don't have too many uh, cities, then you can often just add a, a single item here. And so, like on this one, let's just say we're going to add, add this. You have to put three. Uh, cities in there. You just add the cities in there, and and then once they're done, you can sort them in any way you want. So I'll put finalize. This is kind of a tricky thing. And then once you do that, you have to come down to the to the save list as, and then I'm just going to put this as a short uh, test list. Let's just say that, and. Okay, and then you can put here that you want to use this list on which pages. Like, say we're going to say we want this on basic search and on the listing ID search, and you can just click those and save the changes or all search pages. So this one, we're not going to even use that list, so I'm, I'll just eliminate. I'm just going to put save the changes there. Oh, I guess we have to pick one. Okay. So let's create another list here, and I'll just show you. This is a, if you have if you're going to use all these cities, there's a bunch of them. You just basically want to select the ones you're not going to use. Then what you do is do something like this. Like we'll just add all the cities here from the whole area, and then you can just start clicking on the ones that you're not going to use. And you can see that these the area out of area thing is a little bit crazy. So I'm actually going to sort these in alphabetical order to start out with. Then I can just cruise down here to this um, out of town, out of area, and whatever, and just click the ones, get rid of the ones that I, that we want to remove. Um, the, the MLS here seems to be do a pretty good job. Some of them you'll actually see, um, like here's one right here in you know Missouri. We don't want that there. Of course, that was just in the area we were looking at. So it looks like it's showing everything in the same uh, state at least. So anyway, once that's done, you do the same thing, finalize and continue. And then we'll just put, um, in this case, we'll just put Long Island. City list. And I'm actually going to apply this to all of the pages because I'm, I'm going to make that change. And that's it.